Okay, so I didn't think I'd ever make this video, but I'm actually getting quite excited over this selfie stick here. So this is the new-ish selfie stick from Insta360. And this is the first selfie stick I've been using in a lot of my 360 videos with my Insta360X3 camera here. It's a great size. And I want to do a bit of a review on it to give my experience, show you some of the features and why it's a cool accessory that you should have in your camera bag. You can see my dog seems to think this is a toy as well. The first feature that I really like about this is the fact it's so small. It's about 14 centimeters long compared to one of the other bigger sticks <laughs> that Insta360 have. Obviously this is a big 300 centimeter pole, but it's not very practical for everyday use. This is much more practical to fit into your pocket. So when you actually take it off the camera, obviously the Insta360 camera goes straight in your pocket and this can fit in the pocket as well. Like it's a nice size, it's not gonna clutter up anything in there. It's just really easy to take around. And because it's short length as well, it can be quite discreet. So if you are using your camera in say, an area where you don't wanna attract uh, a lot of attention, say in like a museum or in public, this obviously can be hidden away or even if you want to use it on the camera, but you only want to keep it in the short mode, like this, that is quite discreet and it's not going to attract a lot of attention, which is great. You can also use this in 360 mode as well. So if you want to do like the me mode that's on the Insta 360X3 where you can hold the camera and walk with it, it is still pretty good, but when you don't have the selfie stick fully extended, you may have issues with the stitching line because of how short this is. It'll still work amazing, but it'll work much better in 360 mode when you have the stick fully extended out to here. So let's talk a bit about the build quality of the selfie stick. It is a very robust design. It feels very solid in your hand. It's not too heavy, which is great, but it actually feels like a really good piece of machined kit. You don't have to have that fear of it falling apart like a cheap piece of Chinese accessory you could buy off Amazon or something. It is really robust, it feels solid. And when you actually pull it out, it's made like it's, it's friction. So there's no snaps or there's no joints or no locking things. It's just all based on friction, but it's fairly strong. The friction isn't gonna go anywhere. And once you set your stick where you want it, it's not gonna collapse down with the weight of the camera or it's not gonna move around. Like it's fairly solid. I'm having to put a, bit, a fair bit of force in there to pull that out and push it back together. Really solid design on that front. It's got a nice soft grip here. So the top part of the selfie stick is made of metal and then it has a nice rubber touch on the grip. So it's gonna give you plenty of comfort. Underneath the camera as well, we've got a thread. So if you want to attach this to another uh, tripod mount or anything like that, that Insta360 sells, you can do that. So if you're wanting to capture night lapses, time lapses, things like that. This is where this can come in really handy. And when we're out and about and we want to use our stick to full extension, the stick extends to a complete 69 centimeters. So I can't actually fit that on camera, but that's how big that is. And I'll put a comparison on the screen now so you can see what that looks like in comparison to the 300 centimeter stick. I mean, for how small it folds up, for how much extension you get out of it, I think that's fairly compact and fairly useful. Another thing to note as well, if you have this on a tripod, you can extend this all the way up to eye level as well. So if you were recording a video like this and you were sat talking to a camera or something like that, it would actually get you in the shot, which is great. I've got a ton of different selfie sticks in my camera bag, one of which being this ridiculously long pole, which I don't really use that much, but comes in handy when you wanna get those no drone, no shot problems. No drone, no problem shot, sorry, because of how big it is. But from a practicality standpoint, you don't wanna be carrying this around all the time. For ease of use and how much you can do with this, how big this is, this is always gonna be my camera bag or my rucksack or whatever, just cause it's so simple, so accessible, there's so much you can do with it and it doesn't take up much room at all. And I use this as well with my Insta360 a fair bit. You probably use it with all sorts of cameras. And obviously with the thread on the bottom, if you wanted to, you could actually attach this to this 300 centimeter stick and turn it into an absolute monster. That's a BC. Kind of cool Insta360 does that, so you can attach it to all sorts of different uh, accessories that they offer. This is one of the best selfie sticks I've used for my Insta360 camera. 
I will put a link below if you guys want to go and get this. And as well, there is a link down below to my video settings cheat sheet where you can download all my favorite video settings for this camera and any other types of action cameras for all different types of shooting environments and lighting situations. That's kind of cool. And I hope this video was useful. Any questions on the selfie stick or any other accessories for 360 cameras, pop them below. I'll get back to you. We'll see you in the next video. Take care. All the best.